Life is very uncertain. We never know what it has planned for us. Especially COVID-19 has had a huge impact on all of us. A year ago during the pandemic, my dad and I planned to shoot a portrait photograph. He has over 65 years of experience in shooting these kinds of portraits. Things took an interesting turn when we decided to shoot the entire process on a 4x5 large format speed graphic camera. Speed graphics first model was manufactured around 105 years ago. As it was my first time using a large format camera in the studio, it was quite challenging but exciting at the same time. Being a professional photographer, I knew we had to have a perfect planning to get a successful shot. We therefore started by concentrating on the tiniest details, how to focus with the camera, brainstorming regarding the pose, managing perfect lighting, and so on. We finally had the perfect setup and we took a very beautiful picture of my father. We were finally ready to develop the 4x5 film that we had just taken and following the series of steps. Mixing the developer in the water to process the film where the negative appears. Taking some hypo to make the film permanent. Adjusting the temperature of the developer with the help of thermometer and processing this in a dark room without any kind of light for exact 10 minutes. Since we did not have a night vision camera, we were not able to show the entire process. Finally, we would get a negative which we can then move forward to retouching, printing and digitalizing it. This negative was then transferred to the retouch box. Since there was no such technology like computers, the negative was placed in this box and a sharpened pencil was used to cover up any kind of imperfection. This was how the photo was retouched before Photoshop. This negative was then enlarged using an enlarger and the negative was printed. In the new era, we can simply digitalize the negative by loading the file and adjusting the levels. These are all done through Photoshop and Lightroom. After this composition, here is the final image. During old times, these were the steps that needed to be followed for producing a simple photo. These were the series of steps my father taught me. This process really brought back the good old times. Who knew that this wonderful moment would be the very last time that I would get to spend with my dad.